And the one thing we like about this campground is it has paved roadways. Yes, you have gravel, but you do have a paved roadway in all around here. And two main, two main roads. Yeah, two main roads have paved, paved and makes a real big difference. And you actually have grass. We've stayed in a few where it's just dirt everywhere, just dirt roads, dirt ro site, everything. And so, but this is our site here. And like I said, we really enjoyed it. And when we pull out tomorrow, we'll just pull out this way and head out back on the road again. But we really enjoyed our site. We are here. also at the KOA, they have checkers and chess set here that you can play. There's another view of the putt-putt golf if you want to play putt-putt so These are RC cars. They have a track here for that, which I think is really cool. I've never been to a campground that has an RC track for your RC cars. Um, it's becoming a really big thing. Our son enjoys doing this with his sons. So, but they do have a track here for you if you want to bring out your RC car and do that. So while also over there, we got to meet Laura and Mike Mike from Wandering with the Welches. And we also got to meet these great neighbors that were next to us. Well, we hope you enjoyed this short video of the Traverse City KOA in Michigan. Um, you are probably about 15 minutes from Traverse City, I guess. Yeah, that's probably about right. Not So you're not that far. and They're doing a little construction on the road mm -hmm. right now, so it might take you a little bit longer, but that's yeah. not bad. Yeah, we really... I've had a nice time here. You've only been here for a few days. It's just back on our uh, paper to come back here again. And so back on our map that will come back to this area. There are sleeping bear dunes that are about 40 minutes from here. Yep. And if you get a chance to come here or anywhere around this area, make sure you stop in there and see the sleeping bear dunes. They are uh, kind of fun to, to look at. Tom, <laughs> Tom climbed them. Uh, he went down the dunes to the water and climbed back up and it's very tough. It's a, uh, he can tell you, it's very tough. Yeah, it was, uh, I overestimated the amount of effort it would take yeah. to get up that hill. And so he's got a video coming out on that. So I underestimated. Sure. <laughs> I said <laughs> overestimated. Yeah, I under underestimated. He, he's got a video coming out about that. So be sure to tune in when you see the thing on Sleeping yeah. Dunes because he videotapes some of it. Um, and you also have some beautiful, the water here, I can't say enough about how beautiful the water is on these Great Lakes. It is clear crystal blue it's not salt water no sharks nothing like that yeah, it's phenomenal no, you, <laughs> no jellyfish you can tell him from the east coast um and so it, it it's just been beautiful we've been really enjoyed it and venturing out to see these different little areas here we like we like these little towns and just just the beauty all of them hold and it's just such cute things that we've seen around here and um we just had a really good time and got to meet up with a couple of people yesterday that are also fellow full-timers yeah and we had a good time visiting with them and uh, we head out again tomorrow to go down to another campsite in Michigan and we'll probably videotape that one for you too so you can see how that is uh, if you have any questions or thoughts on this be sure to drop us a line and we'll be able to try to answer your questions if you um, saw things here that we maybe didn't get to let us know because when we come back we'd like to look those up that's right so, and if you see us at the campground, stop and say hi. We'd love to talk to you. So we've got the sticker on the back of our RV that says our venture awaits. And if you see us at the campground, we've met several of you at campgrounds. But if you see us, stop in and talk to us and just say hello. And um, we'd like to meet you. And we, we met one person. Well, we didn't actually meet the person. We were driving across the, the Mackinac Bridge going yeah. to Mackinac City. And somebody put a thing on our post saying, we were right behind you. And I thought, that's really cool. So... Uh, hopefully we can meet them one day, but uh, they, they weren't going to the same campground we were at, but hopefully we can meet them one day. But anyway, we hope you're well. We hope that everything you had a great summer and everything's going good for you. And as we come into the fall, we um, hope you enjoy this the beautiful fall weather wherever you might be. And so I guess that's probably about everything. I think so. Okay. So, so we'll, we'll see, see you around, around the campfire. campfire. Bye. Bye.